Alright guys, ADHD here, back with another video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Last time you guys said I forgot the camera flip, so what was I thinking? Bloop. Your boy's back. And it's, shout out to all the new people. We've gained, I think, like almost 15,000 new subscribers, so... Thank you guys so, so much. Welcome, welcome to the channel where nothing makes sense. So, we're gonna be doing today, this is a series I call Versus. For those of you guys that are new, basically what it is, we take two of the most iconic characters from a certain, this particular episode is based off comic books, but we have three different sections right now. We have comic books, we have horror, and very soon, I'm just gonna tell you guys now, animation. But it's gonna be a lot of fun when we get to that. So today is comic book related. We pick two titans from comic books and pick two of their most iconic weapons they've used ever before and put them head to head and see he would win in the first, uh, this is the third episode of Versus. Alright guys, so for this episode of Versus, if you couldn't tell by the title, we have a few, two, two very, very, very famous, one more recently famous, but very famous comic book characters. The angry, angry, oh Logan himself, oh he's been through so much, oh he's so <laughs> angry. Wolverine right here, and we actually, I actually spent a little bit more money on the mask this time. This one came out pretty cool, I think. Oh, I think so. Look at those, this look is look the, those wrinkles. Look at those wrinkles. <laughs> this is old man Logan. <laughs> Like raisin Logan. <laughs> we got this got a little 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 a little back. But we <laughs> So I don't know what that's there for, but we'll, we'll, don't worry about it. And then we got right here, Hair Man. <laughs> no, you guys know who it is. We got the L'Oreal God himself, the Head and Shoulders God himself. I, about to, I, I just can't like... stop with the hair. <laughs> yeah, yes. Ain't no lice on this head. Maybe some hermit crabs, but. <laughs> <laughs> so we got Aquaman. No more joking inside. All jokes aside. We got Aquaman right here. So today's episode is Aquaman versus Wolverine. All right, but you guys know how versus happens. This is how we decide who goes first. Parker gets to answer. He gets to be like you guys answer right, the question. Right. But I want you guys to answer this. Same question in the comments down below. So, here's the question. Darkness. Okay. Darkness. Yes, now we're in a recession. <laughs> <laughs> We've got no food, right? It's the worst recession ever. No food whatsoever. So Not even like a like french a, fry. It's like a depression. A repression depression. <laughs> It's a recession that is depressing. Basically, you have no food whatsoever, and you okay. need to pick one of these individuals, okay. Aquaman or Wolverine, to help you hunt food for your family. Who do you think would be a better hunter, Wolverine or Aquaman? Okay, well, so it kind of just means, do I like seafood or do I not like, <laughs> like anything else? <laughs> Pretty much. Do you, like, do you like fish? Do you like crab? Do you like shrimp? Do you like okay. lobster? You okay. won't be able to get that with this guy. Okay, so like, is although the, I, I'm yeah. not big on seafood, it's more practical in a survival sense that this is infinite. I think it'll take me no resources at all because he's just gonna do it. Yeah, like, it's just gonna be so so much easier with him. So I'm gonna go with him. Okay, all right. So I, mean, I want a burger. Joe's I want a burger. <laughs> I'm gonna go with Logan because I think he can cook a burger real good. I want that <laughs> but, burger. But it's Parker's choice. So Aquaman is going first. I'm just saying the survival <laughs> sense. Let me know down below who would you guys pick to help you guys survive? Wolverine or steak. Aquaman? I really want a steak. <laughs> <laughs> I really want a steak too. That's why I chose my boy. But let's try some shrimp. Come on, let's go. Is that you? No. Oh. <laughs> I'm not going out there yet. <laughs> what was that? That was you? Come on, get out of here. All right, I'm coming, all right? All right, you just close that door. I'll be out there in a second. You want me to close the door? Yeah. Fine. Wait, you coming from? What? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> Don't even start. Oh my god. <laughs> this is the worst one so far. <laughs> Of all the Versus episodes, this is the worst one so far. Marcus Momoa. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's get you in the light. Let's, get you, let's go ahead and uh, get the joke started. All right, here we go. Oh, yeah. I really feel like a head and shoulder sponsor. I feel like you circa 2012. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, yeah. I feel like that for my think it's me like memory. You look like every band's roadies from the 80s. <laughs> <laughs> Homeless ADHD here, back with another video. First weapon I'm gonna show you guys right now, once I can take myself seriously, it's gonna be a couple hours. I feel like everything's a lot more dramatic with the pull your hair back. What did you say about me, bro? <laughs> You look like you have rabies <laughs> or some other disease that you got too close. I, I'm going to get no, too. You know what I have? I have the thing that only pirates get. I have scurvy. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody who looks like this only has something weird like scurvy. <laughs> so, Aquaman has used, obviously you guys know, his most iconic weapon, which is the trident. We will get to that. But, we're starting out with his other weapon. He's been very, very commonly, which I, to be honest, might be going up on one of my favorite weapons of all time. The spear. <laughs> And this thing is dope. Look at that. Dude, this thing is sick. Reaper. You have to spit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> when you have a face like this, you gotta spit. <laughs> but this thing is so freaking solid. Oh, look at that solid. Oh, wow. Right, wow. So that, that's, that's, that's the test of time. If everything's solid in the world, give it to me. Solid. Solid. Okay, guys. So the reason I like the spear is like you have all the advantage of a knife. 
but you don't have to be so close. You're not even gonna be so <laughs> close. Like, oh, I can get hurt right here. Yeah, but here I can't get hurt. Just <laughs> <laughs> you have an extendo knife. I'm only kind of like holding my breath there. <laughs> you know, like, <laughs> let go or something. This is the extension on a knife. So you get so much damage from a distance. So let's just see how sharp this thing is first off, right? Oh. That was just nothing. That was like nothing. <laughs> and then you can just like. <laughs> well, I'm wet. You gotta stay wet. So as you guys can see, it, it can puncture pretty good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> but what about uh, what about slashing? Maybe it's just not, maybe it's uh, so like, is it sharp all around? No, oh, it's sharp all around. It's a full knife. So watch this. Ready? It's a full knife. So that's what I said I like about this. It's also partially sword because you can just like. Oh! Dang! Gallon! That's a gallon? bleeder! <laughs> the one gallon jug? Gallon! It's, gallon. <laughs> it's literally gushing out. <laughs> this thing is super OP. And the most important thing about it is, man, is it throwable. Oh, is it throwable? Oh, it's throwable. Alright, we're doing a close throw first. Let's see if I can even do it. Are you ready? Let's do it. Oh! Nice! That was All right. sick, that, That's pretty good. <laughs> That is like the funnest weapon to use. You just feel like just, I don't know, you feel kind of like almost invincible. I was just gonna say invincible. Just like, like you have so much range. Like who's gonna come near me when I have this on the end of a stick just <laughs> ready to poke you? Like devastating. Now let's see some range. All right, well, here we go. I'm really nervous. I always feel like your luck is based on your first hit. Really? Yeah, if you don't hit the first time, you're not good at it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, let's see if you're good at it. There's no such thing as practice. If you, if you pick up a basketball, you shoot it one time. If you miss, you're never gonna be in the NBA. Three, two, one. Oh, I hit, but I just missed it. Well, apparently you suck. Damn it! <laughs> oh! 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 We've never thrown anything that goes this deep in the table. There is wow. just so much, like, now I feel like, what's I get craving? Oh my god! <laughs> now I'm craving the hunter. <laughs> For real, guys, look at how deep these freaking coals are. It went all the way. We've never thrown anything that goes that deep. It goes real, real deep. I'm talking seven inches deep. Oh. It's going deep, man. Are you sure seven inches? Man, we're on six. <laughs> All right, guys, you guys know how we do. We give every character a custom challenge. This is a throw what we need to have a throw in it. So this is how it's going to work. Aquaman's character has to slash the middle target, stab, stab, flip, and then throw it through both of these targets over here. And it has to impel both for a collateral hit because he had, yeah, it's pretty strong. I think he could do it. So let's see. Can Aquaman do his challenge? And then we're going to do a challenge with Wolverine. And whoever has the lowest time will give us an estimate of what could do more damage faster. All right, you ready? Oh, I'm ready. All right, let me count down. Three. Two, one, go! Oh! oh yes! Oh yes! Oh my god! <laughs> that and the table. Flawlessly, no mess ups. You know what? I may look like a chick, but I got that power, baby. Yeah, that with that Momoa power. I wouldn't have been able to do that without this wig. Okay, guys. So like I said, this thing has a lot of impaling power. That's crazy. <laughs> Absolutely insane power. I don't even feel like the camera can show you guys how much like follow through it has. Like it just, I really feel like it could go through. If I, I don't have the perfect spear throwing form, which I want to learn. Because as you guys know, I love throwing weapons. I am going to keep this and practice with it. But I think of a perfect form, you could throw that through like 10 jugs if you wanted to. Oh, yeah, dude. It, I I think like four melons. Like it's crazy how much follow through it has. I just want to see how much downward spear strength this has. We've done it with a knife. We've done it with swords, and it can't break through a coconut. But let's see if this can. Ready? Oh, oh my gosh! You can just break through like it's nothing. That felt like nothing at all. And that's like one of the harder things to break through. And it just. <laughs> okay. So that's enough Aquaman for right now. <laughs> I've had off the way. I can take this mask off. Put on another one. Or this hair off. Put on another mask. Next up is Wolverine. And you guys know, your boy took a while to find it, but your boy found the right stuff. We're doing your boy Wolverine right now. Once I uh, rinse and repeat. The other thing fun about this, use the cleanup too. <laughs> Woo! Bald, bald Aquaman. <laughs> Hydrogen Man. All right, guys, so for Wolverine, I don't have the mask on yet, but this mask is a lot better, actually. It's not very comfortable, but it's a lot better. We have a weapon that you guys have seen on this channel before, but they weren't really as good as I could have. Like, I couldn't find anything better. They are the Wolverine claws, but they weren't sharp at all, just the tips were. And trust me, guys, it's very hard to find Wolverine claws, replica claws, that are actually sharp on the blade part, too, not just the tip. But your boy did a little little rule bended, did a little bit of a, you know, a little, a little couple calls. There aren't any calls, like one. But <laughs> your boy! 
got Wolverine gloves. Oh. And show them the sides. They are actual oh, that is blades. Sharp. Oh yeah. These are brand new actual Wolverine blades. Very, very hard to find. But your boy got them for you guys. So drop a like if you haven't already. Drop three likes if you can. <laughs> Here we go, guys. Testing out the Wolverine claws, putting on the mask. Here we go. <laughs> Can't see very much, but <laughs> all right, <laughs> blind Wolverine here. <laughs> okay, so this is the mask. It is look a lot better, but I, I literally, huh? I can barely see, and my eyes are itchy. And there's like a slit. Your eyes are itchy. My eyes are itchy. The, you see the white part? Yeah, the that white is part. literally on my eyeball. There's like a slit. Ah! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Dude. Like I was saying, my eye is literally right there. Could you see it? <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah, actually, yeah. <laughs> It hurts. Okay, so we're gonna try these out. Oh my god, my eyes are burning. Okay, <laughs> so we're gonna try those out. The Wolverine's mask is not as fun as Jason Momoa's wig. So I'm gonna give the points to Aquaman for, for practicality. <laughs> You what? Like, what now? You look like a birthday party Wolverine on break. <laughs> you know, these kids are too goddamn annoying. One kicked me in the shit six times. Done. Done. Listen, Cheryl, I just said, I, that's why I said I want all the money up front, because your kids are What, you're not going to give me any money? I have three reasons why you better get your damn checkbook out, Shannon. <laughs> and the middle one, special for you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, so I'm going to just be, if you look at me, I'm going to be talking, I'm going to be smiling, I'm going to be laughing, but just know on the inside of this mask, I'm crying. <laughs> Right here we have a melon. I'm gonna go do a slash on it if I can see it. And we're gonna see what kind of damage these do. And to be honest, I'm gonna take the mask off in a little bit because I just don't want it to affect how good I can use the weapon. Hey, but you know what? It looks good. Like, it you looks honestly, look, you look menacing. Yeah, that is the thing I've noticed about weapons, guys, is the better they look, the more uncomfortable they are. All right, bub, you ready for this? Oh, oh. that was one slash and it's oh. like butter through it. <laughs> I, I don't wanna stab myself in the hand. Damn, dude! That's beautiful. And it's so freaking sharp, you can just move them out like that. The other ones, you couldn't even do that. Okay, now we got some testing. All right, slash test, here we go. Woo! Oh, boy! Oh, boy! It really did all three of the strikes. Oh, man, that's <laughs> You guys don't know how happy I'm about this? Because like I said, there was no options with the blades in them, and we actually found one. Sick! Yeah, no, I see. Him. I literally right now, guys, have tears from this. My eyeball was literally resting like a, a contact on this material. <laughs> Drop a like if you haven't already for just the dedication. Okay, guys, so I, I, when I'm slashing, you guys can't really exactly see what's happening. So, so like I said, I'm just so pumped because it's so hard to find these ones with the blades. I'm glad we found them. Look at this, dude. This is just such an OP weapon. Oh my god. <laughs> That was nothing. It's like, honestly, kind of scary. Yeah. Just not one wound, not two wounds, but just, uh, just through someone's chest. Oh, God. All right, oh, give, me make room. give me a slash chest. Come on, let's go. You let's got go. this. I couldn't wear the mouse, guys. Sorry. Here we go. Try it. Oh! Dude! In three. <laughs> it cut it in three. And somehow I cut it in four, actually. <laughs> But man, that was oh, cause two cuts it in three. Three cuts it in four. Hey. Man, I Wolverined it. I cut it into four pieces. Dude, that was that was probably one of the sickest things. Ever. <laughs> All right, next up, I'm cutting off Parker's manhood. What? That. That. Throw it. I, I don't want. I want. Throw it. Throw your family <laughs> jewels. <laughs> bro, I'll slash him on you, you bro. <laughs> Wolverine, don't play that. <laughs> All right, are you ready? My that's a weird fruit. My tip. <laughs> Wait, you want your tip back? Grab that on the ground. All right, guys. So for the Wolverine challenge, what we're gonna do is something similar to the uh, the Jason Momoa one, the Aquaman one, except for a little bit bigger because we have this. It's gonna take a lot more hits. But what we're gonna do? Is we have three targets here. I need to slash all three of these targets to completion. Make sure they're finished. Then turn over here and try and drain at least half of this jug's blood. That's how we're gonna do it. We're gonna do the full thing as long as possible. Do the full thing. Try and get us half, and that's when the timer is going to end. All right, give me a countdown. Ready? Three, two. One, go! Oh! Woo! Okay, it's in half. <laughs> and that's Wolverine's rage mode. We're both completely. <laughs> 
I am drenched, dude. That was intense. <laughs> I still don't know if I beat Aquaman's time, but I tried. <laughs> okay, so this is up to you guys. As you guys know how this series, I don't want to say anything to sway you. You guys are going to vote in the top right corner right here. We still have another set of weapons, but technically Wolverine, I think, had more time spent than Aquaman. I mean, come on. He did so much more damage. <laughs> I know, that was like a lot of damage. That's a lot of damage! And if you're talking about like just pure badassery, I mean... I, I mean, it's up to you guys though down below. I mean, obviously Aquaman did have a short time, so they're more, therefore it would be more deadly, I guess, but... That's a lot sicker, in my opinion. <laughs> All right, guys. So with versus, you guys know how it goes. The person that went first in the first round has to go last in the second round. So this is Wolverine's turn again, actually. And I love this mask. It looks sick, but it is very uncomfortable. And I don't think that Wolverine will get a fair, like, ex you know, examination of his weapons I'm using his mask because I cannot see it all. So it just kind of messes up the actual, you know, trying with the weapons. So I'm gonna take this off, unfortunately, guys, just because I want him to have a fair chance at winning. So. So, and not this last video, but the most, uh, uh, a couple videos ago, I had a Roman sword, and I kept calling it a Renaissance era sword instead of a Roman sword. And the reason why I kept doing that was because I had this sword in mind, and I just kept thinking about this sword when I was using that one. But that's why I didn't know it was a Roman sword. Okay, I just didn't, I just was messing with my brain. Because this is a Renaissance sword, right here. This is our Wolverine weapon right here. Oh. Ooh, shiny. <laughs> it is razor sharp. This thing is ready. This is, a re this is what I was trying to talk about in the last video. This is a Renaissance era sword. And you guys know we have the two weapon rule. They have to have at least two. And he barely passed. <laughs> right here. This is be one of my favorite. Look, that just looks sick. Oh, yeah. That, <laughs> that is that's a that sick shine. <laughs> it's dirty right now because my hands. But it is a sick sword. I love the sheath for it and everything, too. So we're going to be trying this out. This is Wolverine's Renaissance era sword. Let's try it. All right, so we're going to test this very reflective sword out in a second here but I just want to see it cutting on it real quick and I want to be badass because you know like, whenever people have these like renaissance era swords they always do a ride out the sheath like <laughs> try it I mean if you be badass let's do it pineapple ready yeah three two one hit it oh, oh! yeah <laughs> And you did it long ways. Oh man, that was just a reaction. This sword is dangerous. This is a very, very scary, scary thing. Dude. <laughs> Throw that up, 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 I dare you. <laughs> oh my God. This thing is ridiculous. And, I, and the best part about it, blinding. <laughs> <laughs> you think you can hit me when you can't see? You can, and then, <laughs> All right guys, so this is the new sword renaissance era, I guess you call it a dexterity test. I'm gonna do some more sword tests in the future, which is basically moving objects. So you have to unsheath your blade, double slash through both melons. Then Parker is gonna be throwing me five moving soda cans that I have to slash through without missing them. If I miss it, I have to poke it to make sure it dies and that'll end my time. So let's see, ready? Let's do it. Three, two, one, go. Oh, I had to trust your judgment. Oh, man. Hey, man, you're pretty accurate on this. I mean, you barely, I think you barely got this one. I did? Oh, yeah, I busted barely. Oh, I busted barely. We've all busted barely. <laughs> All right, so the the blade I would say is awesome, but I'm gonna be honest. I think like mo a lot of swords are a little easier to move around with. This one is not the easiest to move. It's a very very stiff weapon. You guys can vote whatever you guys want, but I will say that this definitely probably was the hardest weapon to use so far. I felt very like restrained. It is so heavy. You really have to commit to your swing. Like you can't like oh wait near my own hit here. It's like you have to just follow through because there's so much weight. <laughs> and then this is always a pr you know, thing. Feels like my grandma trying to thread a needle. <laughs> I'm like just. Yeah, uh, somebody get in my thimble. Oh, there it goes. <laughs> okay, guys. So for the last weapon, you guys know it's Aquaman's famous trident. I know what you guys are expecting. You guys are expecting to see the trident from the movie. But sometimes in verses, this is going to happen where the item in fiction doesn't exist. I looked everywhere in the world for a trident, and this is the best thing I could find. And I know it's kind of small, but it is very, very dangerous and very sharp. And we have, we have physics and to grapple, whatever it is. So basically, if you guys know, a trident is not supposed to be as big as Aquaman's is. It's Aquaman's. They do not exist. You 
could not buy them. I looked everywhere in the world, and we are testing their real world equivalent weapons. This is the real world equivalent. It has five prongs just like his, but they're a lot smaller because obviously in real life, a fish is a lot smaller. You could kill a shark with this, you know? We're not Aquaman in real life. We're trying to take down, we're not trying to take down like a mel megalodon, you know? So we're gonna try this right now and see what kind of damage does. I'm excited because it's like a spear, but with five tips. Yeah. <laughs> Basically. Much. Here we go. Let's do some testing on this five daggered spear. <laughs> All right. So what we're gonna do first off is here, I want to see the prong damage, like see this go into something. So let's imagine it's a very fat fish. Fin is swimming very slowly under the water, okay? And I'm a hunter. <sighs> a lesbian hunter. <laughs> 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 Oh. I didn't even get to see the five frog. I just went straight through it. Dude, dude. Oh, dude. You can see. Oh my god. Okay, guys, so this is what I wanted to show you. So, with a fish, the way it would work is it would stuck in it and it killed the fish. But if he was fighting Wolverine or anybody else, it would get stuck and these prongs that are inside would literally rip the organs out of the person. Oh. Here's a perfect example right here. Guys, you see this actual watermelon right there. It would actually be pulling out flesh. Like if you stabbed into a zombie's chest, you would come out with some zombie. It would be ripping through the organs on the way out. And the favorite thing about this is this. You can use it to grab stuff the oh, same yeah. way Aquaman does because of those hooks. It grabs on to its opponent. So we're gonna do the Aquaman challenge with this one. Aquaman tried it throw. Here we go. Ready? Let's do it. Well, you really smack the heck out of it. I feel like I'm throwing a fork at my food. <laughs> Three, two, one. Oh, Ooh, man, you clotheslined it. <laughs> no, dude. What? What? Damn it! Oh. Okay, guys, so it didn't come with a handle. We had to buy a handle. And this handle's a piece of shit. Okay. Oh my god! No. It literally was a piece of crap. Oh my god. I just god. threw it on the floor and it broke. Wait a minute. <laughs> this is literally the worst. Okay, so we got it on a, a broom handle. And it looks even more, it looks like a tool for sure now. But I mean, it looks cool. It, it looks, looks cool. All black. Yeah, it looks cooler all black, but it's like Aquaman, guys, you have to understand, Aquaman does not use a weapon. A trident is not a weapon. A trident is a fisherman's tool. So that is what we are using here. For Atlantis! Oh! Did it just stab through the trash can? It just stabbed through the trash can. My favorite trash can at that. And I can't get it out because that fish hook. Damn it! For Atlantis! Oh, man, that was like effortless. It really is. And like I said, because of the barb, <laughs> literally everything you hit with it gets stuck because of that barb. Except oh. when you just blow it up. <laughs> Okay guys, so for the Aquaman challenge, you guys know Aquaman is more, most famous for probably harpooning animals and just oh, like, you know, he's known for swinging things around with the harpoon. So what we're gonna be doing for this challenge, I have to stab the jug, lift it, cause it has the barbs, and slam it on this table over here. Then do it all three within a less time of the sore one. Are you ready? I'm ready, do you do it? All right, I'm walking. This hair is real, real, really in the way though. All right, ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one, go! Uh. 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 Nice. Uh. Nice. Uh. Nice. Uh. 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 Aquaman! <laughs> it, was, it looked a lot cooler when it was still up, so I just... Aquaman! <laughs> that was pretty sweet. <sighs> <laughs> And if you're new here and you haven't hit the post notification, which I know probably some of you guys are new, you just maybe subscribe, hit the post notification. You guys do not miss a video when I post it. That is it, guys. You guys let me know who do you guys think won. Do you guys think Aquaman won or Wolverine? All you have to do is vote for it using the card system in the top right side of your screen. It's a little bubble up there. Hit that, and that's how you guys will vote, and that'll decide who will carry on in the series.